What's up, I'm Troubleshoot, super impromptu, very important video. If you have downloaded the increased stack size mod, which was a trending mod and super popular on Nexus mods for schedule one, you have been compromised. Within the past 24 hours or so, the developer, as far as I understand, sold their account and this mod was replaced with a Trojan, which of course likely steals your information, logins, etc. If you downloaded the increased stack limit mod within the last 24 hours, now the page has been taken down since April 11th, then you've likely been compromised. This was a very, very popular mod. The best place to keep up with this information is of course the Schedule 1 modding server Discord, which you'll find linked down below. There's a warnings channel there I'd recommend you follow very closely just to find out if some other suspicious behavior happens. Here, they spoke about a user Froggy who's since been removed from this Discord, where this increased stack limit mod was updated to include suspicious lines starting a new process with a bunch of obfuscated code doesn't create a window, so it's completely hidden, and it runs things in the background besides downloading things over here. Super, super worrying. Again, if you downloaded this mod within the past 24 hours, run some kind of an antivirus on your PC and change all of your passwords, Steam, Discord, YouTube, everything that you can think of that you've logged onto on your current PC through use of another device, be it a mobile phone, tablet, second computer, etc. Don't use your compromised device to log into important accounts until you've at least run an antivirus and made sure that there's nothing suspicious running in the background. These kind of Trojan horses happen pretty often within the modern community for every game. Schedule 1 is no exception. You're downloading code from other people, trusting them implicitly, and running it on your own system. Whatever privileges Schedule 1 had at the time of running, which is usually the user level, so you can access your documents, different files here and there, except for a couple of things in the Windows folder, etc. That's exactly how much permission mods within in Schedule 1 and every other game for that matter have when you run them on your PC. Regardless, this mod is malware. It has since been removed from Nexus mods. This can happen at any stage in the future. It's terrible when it happens, as it can just happen at any time, to any game, to any community. So yeah, stay safe out there. Hopefully you found this video useful. Again, share it with everyone you know who's modded Schedule 1, or at least just let them know that they need to get rid of the increased stack limit mod if they have it on their system, which was produced and published by froggy p1 absolutely dead serious change your passwords now i'll see you all next time ciao